All right, y'all, we're on the water, 7.30 in the morning. 37 degrees out here. And I'm gonna try a little something here around the dock this morning, y'all. And uh, may take the boat on out, and again, might wait till tomorrow. I've been wanting to try something here. So, let's get some rods faded up. Feel that bad out here for 27. I mean 37. Had a couple hits. Uh, nothing, just taking it for a good pull. Be a plus if I could catch one or two out of here without taking the bow down. Big old, big old car. Not bad, John. Get some scale on it. Thirteen pounds even.
Y'all, this is pack bait I made three weeks ago, and it's still working great. I take it home, put it in the refrigerator. I got a oatmeal, cereal, corn, everything made in it. And just pack it all together. Got lime jello. We ain't been here this long. We got a 13 pounder and lost one, so hopefully. Now I will be making a video on showing you how to make this pack bait. I got a video coming out today on making the hair, hair rig, rigs, and uh making some of my corn stuff. So check all my videos out, subscribe, get fish too. Now I want to touch base with you about carp fishing. It's a, I catfish all my life. Back in my teenage years, I used to carp fish a lot. We'd go out and carp fish during springtime when everything's on bed. Action going on, me and all my friends, we'd get out and hang out and make a little side bets, have our own little cart tournaments and everything. And uh, this sport here, y'all, is ever much as fun as fishing for the catfish. They fight, they don't give up till you got them in the boat. And as far as me, it don't matter the catfish or the carps because I'm not keeping any of them. I'm releasing everything. And carp fishing is, it's really becoming popular over here now, but overseas, it's uh, bigger than bass fishing for the folks overseas. But if you had not never tried it, it's a lot of fun building your rigs, making your baits and getting out and catching these things and uh, fighting them and everything. So catfishing is, you got to chase bait and everything. And I love it and everything, but you got everybody watching you and they think it, those catfish just lives in one spot. And they, if they see you, they want to get out and follow you and get on your spots and everything. And I'm just out for the fight of the fish and everything. And, Give this give this carp fishing a chance. You'll really like it. Number two, we lost one, y'all. Get the scale on them. Six point three seven, y'all.
Seven five. What's that? Like big old piece of gear corn. Why, it's these cardinals here. Okay. Well, how long are I cool, man? I'm just trying. All right, baby, it's up to you. Seven five. I thought he'd be bigger than that. But seven five, but I'll sure take them, y'all. Yeah. Good 
Size. Yeah, I've caught five so far. That size? Uh, one's a little bit bigger than this one. This one's 10 pounds. One, I got one thirty three. Yeah, one thirty three. Number five, y'all. 13, 10, 7, 5, 6. Catching all sizes. Be sure and subscribe to Catfish Terry. Hit those buttons, share us out, y'all. Number six, Nathan, buddy. Seven point two six. Got a bad knee. Need to get Tom Kelly down here in these. Be a lot of fun for Tom. I'm about out of pack bait. This bait is what I made three weeks ago. I started to throw it away and I figured what the heck, I'll come down here and try it. It's pretty good when you ain't even got to get the boat out of the dock. And like I was saying, y'all, catfishing is fun, but you can have just as much fun fishing for these carp. If you're not fishing for fish to eat, these here, they don't stop fighting until you get them in the boat and then they're still flopping around. And it's a heck of a sport. They're beautiful fish once you sit and look at them and everything. I want to catch one of those mural carps and sh that's what I want to get a hold of. Nathan caught one the other day, but uh, they're actually a beautiful fish. But like I say, be sure and check all my videos out. I've got videos on making the bait the rig, tying the rig we use, and 
little bit of everything, y'all. And let me know if it's some kind of video you want to see. It was chilly this morning, 37 when I first got here at 7.30. Like I say, every time you catch one of them in these docks like this, it, it spooks the fish, they'll leave, and then they'll turn around and come back. And the people walking around don't help me, they're making the noise and everything. But carps are actually a smart fish, they remember where the bait is and everything. Alright y'all, I hope you enjoyed the video. We're going to call it a day. Thanks for watching, subscribe, a lot more to come. I had a blast today. So uh, check all my other videos out and a bunch of how-tos and, and we'll be back out here hitting them again, y'all. Thanks for watching. Treat everybody the way you want to be treated. Tom Kelly, Monster Fish Gal, uh, Moon Over Miami, all you great people out there. Uh, thanks for watching. Make sure you got Carver family and the coach place. Till next time. Treat everybody the way you want to be treated. Love everybody. Yeehaw. Thank you for watching.